YouTube family. This is Damon Ritchie, aka Electrician on a Mission. Hold on, hold on. Let me let me let me see if you can see that. Let's check that out. That's the new that's the new t-shirt up under my company shirt. Electrician on a mission. I'll give you a better look at that later on. Anyway, this is a couple quick tips when you're running MC cable through these metal studs. Okay. Real quick. I'm doing a private school. Just want to show you this real quick. You see this MC cable? 12-2 shielding. You see that real quick? You see the how smooth that side is? Now you flip it around. Let me show you. When you flip it around, you see those grooves? It makes it harder to pull. So let's say you're trying to get this thing through a hole right here and you're pulling against it while well, you're making it hard. You flip it the right way and it slides through. It slides through. So that's one thing. When you're running your MC cable, make sure that the shielding is going with the studs and not against the studs. See the difference? All right. Another thing, quick tip real quick, guys and girls. Always strip one end longer than the other. Why? Because once I land this into the box, it'll be long enough for me to make up my pigtail. It'll be long enough for me to make up my pigtail, put a ground screw in there, connect my green, and make it all up right when I'm there. So I don't have to come back to it later. And basically, it'll come out looking like this. Ready to go. You got your ground, your hot, and your neutral. Ready to go. So already made up. P-ring on. Plaster ring, a.k.a. P-ring. So all you got to do is stick your fingers in there, pull out the wire, and uh, install the device. No making up here, scratching up your fingers. So that's just a couple quick tips. Ran a little conduit up there. So you can see it for the home run. All right. Everybody take care. Be safe. And remember, check the power yourself. Never trust anyone. It's an electrician on a mission, and I'm out.